locked. Easy. What's that noise? That's weird. There's a strange glow coming from inside. Hello? Is someone in there? She comes, she comes. Who are you? Part of a hole. Left beyond. Safe here. Leave me. Are you the Countess? Countess, one of our names. Yes. I no longer live. I need to take you out of here. No. Save you. Warm here. I stay in warm places. Too cold out there. Well, um, see ya. I'm talking to an oven. A sound idea. I'm sure it made more sense than most people I know. So this is the kitchen. Such a bare and emotionless place. Not even a bottle of ketchup. Mr. Gould? She returns. Say, can you spare a few dollars for the Joe Gould Fund? I'm afraid I'm a little short. Fair enough, fair enough. Does something about that oven look strange to you? Nothing about my life has ever made sense. Why should an oven be any different? I'll talk to you later. Sure, sure, sure. Things to do, people to see, I understand. Mr. Mitchell? Yes? Why don't you give him a cigarette? When you give that man a cigarette or a drink, he likes to talk. And the only subject Joe Gould likes to talk about, at length, is Joe Gould. And the only person for him to talk to is me. So, I do not give him a cigarette. Gould has left the room. I see. Thank you for that. Have you reconsidered giving him a cigarette? I suppose I have been a little hard on the man. Here, I don't smoke anymore anyway. Give him the whole pack. The oven in the kitchen is talking. Is it now? This doesn't surprise you. Miss, look where we are. I stopped being surprised ages ago. Thanks for talking, Mr. Mitchell. I'll see what I can do. Thank you, Miss Blackwell. Joseph Mitchell wanted you to have this. Ah, uh, nice contribution to the Joe Gould Fund. Mr. Gould? She returns. Say, can you spare a few dollars for the Joe Gould Fund? I'm afraid I'm a little short. Fair enough, fair enough. Liking your cigarette? It's delightful. Here, yeah, feel free to join me. Uh, thanks, but I don't smoke. You might as well keep it. When a man is rich, he can afford to be generous. I'll talk to you later. Sure, sure, sure. Things to do, people to see, I understand. Is this warm enough? Warm. Safety. The flame will carry me. Thank you. That sounds ominous. I can't explain it, but I have the feeling that my time in this place is ending. I'm breaking the link. It'll all be over soon. Over, yes. I can't say that I ever understood any of this, but I do know one thing. Gould was right. We are connected. Every single person on the planet. It's a pattern so complex that we can't even begin to understand it. So don't try to understand it. Gould tried, and he lived a miserable life. Just live, and be happy in living. Anyhow, you best get gone. You got a job to finish. This place is starting to fade. That's good, right? Once this place is gone, the link is gone too. 
the killing will stop. This means something to you, the killing. She killed someone right in front of me. I want to stop that from happening again. Imagine that. Genuine heart. Your predecessor was not graced with such compassion. Predecessor? Do you mean Lauren? My Auntie Lauren? We should not stay here. This place will soon cease to be. Come. It's broken! The bond is broken! I'm free! Way to go, Red. My head. I understand everything. Everything? I hurt people. Yes, that was you. But look, whatever happened, it's done. You can't do anything about it now. It's time for you to move on. No, this should not have happened. He will not kill again. Hey! It's about time you got back here. What did you guys do? I did it, Joey. I broke the bond. Yeah, you broke it all right, and our friend just blew. She did not enter the white light? No. Oh, that is a problem. She has free will and is loose in the world. With the power she has, who knows what damage she can cause. Great, just great. I don't know who you are, lady, and I don't care. But just leave the spook work to us, okay? I have little choice in the matter. I am bound to this plane. What happens next is up to you. Wait! Let's get out of here. Whoa. Little dizzy. Careful, kid. You've never been under for that long. At least I'm alive. Yeah, everything's peachy. There's a killer ghost on the loose and it's our fault. But we broke the link. She doesn't have to kill anymore. You want to tell her that? Who would she want to kill anyway? I think she's going to kill Charlie Meltzer. Oh, him. The guy who wants me dead. Yeah, ironic as all get out. We'll sort it out later. Let's get going. Let's go. It's about time. Let's scram. The door's open. This can't be good. Oh no. We're too late. You... you stay back. Paul, what happened? Charles, he... he... Something took him. I've never seen anything like it. What happened? The... the roof. She took him to the roof. Let's go. There was a stairway down the hall. Did... did Charles really kill people? Yes. I'm sorry. I didn't know. I swear, I didn't know. Give me one reason why I should spare you. Please, I'm not a killer. I, I had no idea you were real. I am as real as death. I thought it was just wishful thinking. And just what are you wishing for now, false guide? Hey! Don't interfere. For over 50 years I've been a slave to false guides, but none have been more corrupt and pitiful than this one. Haven't you killed enough? I was just a tool! This man is the hand that wielded it. He used it against you! You want to spare his life? I have killed countless innocents and my hands are stained with their blood. If I must kill, let it be one who deserves it. False guide, it is time to reap what you sow. No, please. I think I found something of yours. What? What is that? It's a part of you. Isn't it? <sighs> it was torn from me so long ago. Here, take it. I cannot. I am not the same person I once was. Hey, we've all changed. And sometimes we just have to accept it. Now why don't you take a hold of this and we can finish it? You... You are the most guilty of all. What? What? You know what you did. Hey, get off! What are you talking about? My death. That was self-defense. 
You must be held accountable. Now you've done it. You might have had it bad before, but now you're on my turf. Something is different about you. You're wrong. Everything about you is wrong. You don't know the half of it. Joey, it's not working. Of course it's not. She's too strong for you. What do you think you're doing? Trying to save your butt. Get away from her! No, that's not what I meant to happen. Wake up, Red. Damn it, wake up! This place. The light. I remember. Just head towards it. I went through once, and I was dragged back. It hurt. It hurt so much. The Link brought you back, but it's gone now. You understand? You're free. You don't have to hurt anyone anymore. My mind is so broken. But here, everything is so clear. That man, Meltzer, he lives? Yes. We stopped you before you could kill him. Is that justice? I wonder. He is a murderer. He will find ways to kill again. But you are right. It is no longer my concern. What do you mean? Live your life. Help the lost spirits of the world. Let nothing deter you. This work is more important than you will ever know. Goodbye, and good luck. Wake up, will ya? Wake up! I'm not spending 20 years over another hospital bed. I'm not. Get up or I'll kill you, you hear? Ugh. Thank God. You okay? Fine. She's gone. Gone? You sure? Yeah. She went through the light. She's gone. Good. Then I just got one question for you. What the hell were you thinking? I thought you were... Never mind what I thought. That was really stupid. Yeah, stupid. I only saved your life. I don't have a life to save. You only risked your own. Joey, I'm soaking wet. And Charles needs an ambulance. If I'm getting a lecture, I'll listen to it at home. This isn't over. No, this is crazy. It's the only way. Why change what isn't broken? But it is. We can't keep blundering around like we have. We stopped a killer ghost today. I wouldn't call that blundering. It was pure luck. We just happened to run into her while doing something else. So? So think of what we could accomplish if people knew about us. People should seek us out, not the other way around. What do you want to do? Put up a billboard in Times Square? No. We've got a special place nowadays. A place where you can talk about all sorts of crazy things and it's accepted as normal. What's that? The internet. What, that computer box? No way. Look, I've trusted you so far, right? Yeah, I guess. Then trust me. Just this once. <sighs> if we end up in a padded room, I'm going to make your life a living hell. You know that. Sure. Come on, pull up a chair. I'll show you what I have in mind.
The link is gone, but I still remain. How long have I been here, trapped between worlds? The others could not help me. Perhaps this new one will. She is just beginning to come into her power. I just hope she is strong enough when the time comes. <laughs>